how to use the text to speech. The most realistic voice I have tested. As you can see here, we have two icons on our desktop. The one is for text to speech, and the other one is for speech to text. Before we test the speech to text, let's first test the text to speech secret free software. I will need to hide the icon of the free software. If you want to get this software, please read the description of this video to get it right now. To create a text to speech, first place down a text containing your script. For example, now go to the text to speech tab and choose the voice you want to use on your project. This is how you create text to speech free forever. This is how you create text to speech free forever. This is how you create text to speech free forever. Once you have chosen the voice you want, simply press the start reading button to create the audio file now. This is how you create text to speech free forever. Now, let's export the video with the voiceover to the desktop. Don't worry, I'll show you shortly how you can extract the audio from the video to use the voiceover on any video you want. This is how you create text to speech free forever. Let's convert this voiceover into text using Adobe Premiere. Pay attention carefully while I'll disable my internet connection as proof that you can do this even if you are offline. You don't need an internet connection to turn any voiceover into text. Now let's open up Adobe Premiere. Create a project. and drag and drop the voiceover into Premiere. As you can see, the voiceover we just created is in video format. To turn it into audio, just unlink the video from the audio and clear the video part. What's left is the audio only. Here you are. This is how you create text to speech free forever. All that's left is just the audio of our voiceover. Let's turn this audio into text now. Note that you can do this to any audio, even if it was recorded using your microphone. But before we start, let's check if we're still disconnected from the internet. To turn this audio file into text, just go to the Window tab and select Text. Press the transcribe sequence button and wait for it to finish loading. This video is playing in real time, so I won't fast forward and you can see how quickly it generates text from an audio file. This is how you create text to speech free forever. To start adding a caption to your video, Press this button and change only these to sliders. You can leave everything else at default. Since I just want to create a TikTok style caption, I will just lower the maximum length in characters. You can increase this if you want to create a caption similar to those in movies or documentaries. This is how you create text to speech free forever. To change your text's design, go to Essential Graphics and click Edit. You can then modify the design or layout individually. This is how you create text to speech free forever. This is 
how you create text-to-speech free forever. This is how you create text-to-speech free forever. You can also change it if for whatever reason you want to make this word free as a capital letter. This is how you create text-to-speech free forever. This is how you create text-to-speech free forever. This is how you create text-to-speech free forever. This is the voice sample that is exported from my free text-to-speech software. If you think you already have this kind of voice using a secret software, please order the speech to text from the variation option instead. In this video, I'll show you how to create captions from any voice, even if it's your own voice that you're using. If there are different people in one audio, the speech to text function will automatically separate each of them with person one, person two, etc. The great thing about the speech to text feature of Premiere is that you can use it even if you're offline or don't have an internet connection. This is the voice sample that is exported from my free text to speech software. If you think you already have this kind of voice using a secret software, please order the speech to text from the variation option instead. In this video, I'll show you how to create captions from any voice.